Ladies and gentlemen, we are back up and running for episode 188 for what could potentially be the shortest indie news we've done in a very long time. How about Because we that? have no upcoming shows. Yeah. We got some results. We got a couple, a couple news stories. So let's get on with results. What happened? On Friday. Uh, yeah, that yeah, day. Friday. AIWs. We got a dilemma. <laughs> More like we got a Tennille Dashwood. That doesn't make sense. Shut up. Uh, oh, well, drop my other phone. You don't uh, need that. No, I don't. Uh, Jock Samson defeated Mance Warner, the man with the dumbest name I've ever heard. Uh, Matthew you have such a grudge against Mance Warner. Mance is a stupid name. <laughs> uh, Matthew Justice defeated Lewis Linden, Tim Dunst, and Calvin... Do you remember Calvin? Tankman. Tankman. Yeah, I remember something big sounding. <clears throat> uh, MGF defeated Colt Cabana. All right. Uh, he's making waves, man. Yeah. He hasn't been around too long, but he's picking up some big wins. Mr. Maxwell. If I'm not mistaken, Chicken he freedom. threw pee at Cole Cabana and then rolled him up. Still. Uh, Filthy Tom Lawler defeated Dominic Garini. Uh, the Philly Marino Project uh, defeated the Jollyville Buckets, 2 Infinity, and Eric Ryan and Bobby Beverly. Uh, the Twins, PB Smooth and Swaggle. My new favorite tag team. Uh, defended the tag titles. Yeah, they were they were against them. Dedication personified. We didn't even know they were tag team champions. Yeah, Tennille Dashwood, who was on the show, defeated Britt Baker. Uh, she was on the show? Yeah. Wow. Frankie Flynn, Magnum CK, Derek Direction, Eddie Only, and Danhausen defeated AJ Gray, Trey Lamar, Josh Bishop, Oliver Woods, and Garrison King. No, Chase Chase Oliver. Chase Oliver. Oliver Woods. I don't know. That okay, that just popped out. Uh, Chase Oliver. And Garrison King. Ten man tag. Lots of names. I was trying to read them really fast. You did good. Uh, Joey Janela defeated DJ Z to retain the intense championship. <laughs> and did. Nick Gage defeated Tracy Williams to retain the absolute championship. What a dick. Yeah. I mean, Nick. What a Nick. What a... What a... What a Nick. Dick fucking Gage. <laughs> yeah. uh, uh, definitely. Well. What happened on Saturday? Beyond Wrestling's first of two shows over the weekend. It's called, I want it all, yeah, yeah, um, <laughs> and I want it now. Where Janela B defeated the Beaver Boys, Martin Stone defeated Wheeler Utah, the Amityville Project defeated Massage NV, DJ Z, in his only victory this weekend, spoiler alert, defeated Brandon Watts, <laughs> Doom Patrol defeated American Strong, Orange Cassidy defeated Bill Carr, Ricky Shea and Page defeated Josh Briggs, John, uh, Skyler, <laughs> I almost said John Skyler. <laughs> Well, that is an indie wrestler, but yeah. this is just the woman named Skyler. Yeah, she defeated Jordan Grace. Hot Sauce Tracy Williams defeated MJF to bring him down a little notch after that Colt Cabana victory. <laughs> and uh, and boost himself up after losing to Nick yeah. Gage. Uh, but then Nick Gage defeated Joey Janela. All right. Which isn't fair because Janela actually had to wrestle earlier in that tag team match. So, mm. win. Ring of Honor. Yeah. In three, two, one. The Young Bucks defeated SoCal Uncensored in a tag team match. It was just uh, uh, Scorpio Sky and Frankie Kazarian. Daniels then attacked the Young Bucks after the match. Cody was at ringside for commentary, but took his sweet-ass time getting into the ring, so he kind of helped run off uh, SoCal Uncensored, but it was mostly Hangman Page swinging a chair around like a crazy motherfucker. Then... ROH did what I hoped they wouldn't do, and they showed us clips from the Women of Honor Wednesday matches that you can see on their YouTube channel, where Kelly Klein defeated Bonesaw Brooks and moved on to the second round to face uh, Mandy Leone, and Deanna Perrazzo defeated Holly Dead. Uh, her opponent has yet to be announced because their matches will be taking place in the coming weeks. Uh, <clears throat> and then in the main event, Kenny King defeated Silas Young to become the new ROH television champion. Uh, Brian Malonis and Beer City Bruiser were causing some issues at ringside. They were kicked out quickly by Bully Ray. And, yeah, it was a pretty fucking awesome, pretty awesome match. Uh, Kenny King ended up winning with that corner Booker T kick. Or the, uh, the, the pin where he, like, yeah. hooks and then does the roll-up. So, so the, the little sunset flip. Yeah. Move. So, really cool. And then next week we're going to be getting... The Briscoes versus the Best Friends, which is interesting considering one of our news stories. Uh, Christopher Daniels versus Hangman Page. And opponents at the 16th anniversary will be partners as Dalton Castle will team with Jay Lethal to take on Punishment Martinez and Marty Skrull. Hmm. Very interesting main event next week. Yeah. But let's round it out with our third and final indie show. 
Beyond Wrestling, back on Sunday with Abandanza. Yeah, we think that's how it's in. Sure. Uh, where Janelope opened up again, defeating Doom Patrol this time. Hey. Uh, Josh yeah, Penelope Ford pinning Chris Dickinson. Yeah. Awesome. Josh Briggs defeated DJ Z. Uh, Team Pog defeated the Beaver Boys. Nick Gage defeated Ricky Shane Page in a million trillion thumbtack match. 20,000. Uh, Amityville Project defeated... Uh, the Viking War Party and the Hooligans. Yep. I just exaggerated because I don't give a shit with Nick Gage. I know. Uh, Wither Yuta defeated Maxwell Jacob Friedman slash Feinstein slash F uh, to become the winner of this year's tournament for tomorrow. Good job, uh, Utah. LAX defeated American Strong uh, and to become the new Powerbomb.tv champion, Hot Sauce Tracy Williams defeated Jonathan Gresham and Martin Stone in a three way dance. You know, one day, I, I have hope for this new green ant. I feel like he'll be just as good as Tracy Williams. Someday. Maybe. That mm. You know, uh, here, here's a little news story if we want to get right into yeah, the news yeah, stories. Yeah, we're, we're at uh, news, so go for it. There was a dark match that happened after this weekend's Chikara Hour of Power, which I know we don't cover here on the rundown. No. Uh, we just cover their main shows. Uh, there was a debuting thief ant. Thief ant? Yes. Huh. Interesting. Yeah. I'm intrigued. Well, to see you. Have to see what that turns into. I mean, yeah. We we know we know there's potential of them building a new colony, but uh I don't know. Thief ant seems like a bad yeah. person to be getting yeah. in, getting into uh interesting choice. Yeah. Uh yeah, so as far as news, I'll I'll hit mine first since mine's real sad. <laughs> Or scare it's, it's it's unfortunate. Yeah, that's a good uh, one. So yeah, despite having a tag team match next week on ROH TV, in current times, Trent Beretta won't be wrestling for a while because apparently, while challenging Chuck Taylor for the PWG World Championship, he tore both of his triceps. I want to know, one, did it happen simultaneously? Ow. Or two, what, or two, just not even or, just how. Yeah. Because, I mean, he he worked the New Japan Honor Rising shows as well. Yeah. So, I, you know, maybe it started, I don't know. That's, that's just, that is a shitty injury. And, and get it, well. It can't, it can't be like the most severe of tears if he worked those other shows directly right. afterwards. Uh but yeah, don't expect his name to be popping up on anything except for pre-taped ROHs in the near future. Yeah. So get well soon, Trent. Uh, get your arms feeling better. That boy. sucks, man. That sucks a lot. Uh, on a slightly more positive news, uh, former world heavyweight champion of the WWE, or the WWE as a different real American likes to call it, <laughs> Super Patriot Jack Swagger. Super or- Patriot. <laughs> <laughs> or Swaggy Jackson. Swaggy Jackson uh, will be is name. debuting on this season of yeah. Lucha Underground. Apparently, yeah, he was on a on an Instagram story uh, working out with uh, uh, Johnny PJ Black. Jo- yeah, uh, PJ Black, Jeff Cobb, and I think Johnny Mundo. Johnny Mundo and, and Taya. No, there's just some other dude with a beard that it looked like a dime store Seth Rollins. It might have been. Uh, it might have been... What's Johnny Windows fanboy? I don't remember. It might have been him. <laughs> uh, so, yeah. Um, I, I am, I'm excited to see what role yeah. Jack Swagger has in Lucha I'm, Underground. I'm, I'm petitioning right now. If he's not Swaggy Jackson, I will be so disappointed. Well, prepare to be disappointed because I don't think he's going to be Swaggy Jackson. Uh, but with that being said, we have up- no up- upcoming... Up- Shows, but we have a lot that'll this is be happening. A segment that I like to call upcoming nose. Upcoming nose. Uh, we will be having quite a few the first couple weeks of March, though. So yeah. look forward to more shows and a coming lot soon. just kind of building towards WrestleMania weekend because you know everyone likes to culminate into that same city wherever WrestleMania is happening and just doing a shit ton yeah. of shows. So we got yeah. Joy Janela's Spring Break. Spring Break Two. Spring Break is coming up. 
Uh, Shimmer 100 is going to be there. Yep. A lot of shows happening. WWN Live is probably going to put on another <laughs> show marathon. Like House of Hardcore has got a show uh, on Saturday. So, yeah, there's going to be a lot of stuff happening that weekend. Tons so of coverage. Prepare for that. And Pre- trouble and make it double. Jesse. The Road Dog. Jesse James. Now I'm confused. Thanks for watching, guys. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Click the links. There are so many social media links that we have in all of our videos, but that's just not the ones we're caring about right now. We are... We care. Less, though, than normal, but more about the ones above our links, the websites of the various independent promotions that we talk about on a regular basis will be posted above ours... I'm talking ROHWrestling.com. ChikarPro.com. CZ Dub Wrestling. CZ Wrestling.com. That's the one. Yeah. Pro Wrestling Gorilla.com. And many more. And we want to add more based on your suggestion using those social media links. Send us links to your favorite and or local promotions, their websites, their Facebooks, their YouTube, YouTube pages. Anywhere that, they, that we can take a look at what they got going on. If they have upcoming shows. And please, within 24 hours, the results of said shows. If we like what they got going on, we will not only continue to talk about them on a regular basis, but we give you a shout out for bringing them to our attention. Breathe, we also man. want you to check out our podcast. That's the link over there that says SoundCloud. And Reasonable Wrestling Fan. It's Reasonable with a W. Like, like wrestling. wrestling. Where we have a brand new unboxing video where you can see us get our little brawling buddy, no, micro brawler, micro brawler. animal, and a bunch of other things. So yeah. check that out. We all also have some punishment videos this that we horse popping up pretty soon. Sh- shirt that he's wearing. <laughs> horse men. Oh. Four horsemen. Four horse meat. Uh, you can check out all the unboxing videos, our punishment videos, and other videos that are ba- loosed based loosely around wrestling. Thanks for watching, guys, and we'll see you at whatever video, when I can speak better, you decide to watch next. And as always, Fuck Fuck Mojo. Mojo.